Hey, what's good? What's good, everybody? Wait a minute now. There's a black dude that's working over here? Y'all gotta hold on one second. I'm about to veer off. Let's check this out. Hold on, I'm finna go to Axis, brother. Excuse me. What's up, man? Are you an American black dude? Hold on, let me come up here. I'm just, I just spotted a rarity. That's why I'm coming up here. Are you an American black dude? Where are you from? Okay. Well, still, I guess period, because I've never seen a black dude on this site at all. Oh, okay. So, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not I am no immigration or anything. Uh, okay. Well, because I was like, because I look at all these sites all around Arlington, I don't, I don't see any of us. And so, yeah, I'm stopping here to say, yeah. A, a, so how many of y'all, by the way? <laughs> That's a damn shame. I mean, there are other guys in here working, but... Uh-huh. I'm not, I don't have you on camera, by the way. No. Yeah. So do you think that's... Do you look at that as possibly an, an, like this, like something weird about that? Or are you just like, hey, I'm just going to work and move on? I mean, I've been in the system for a while, so I'm used to it. You used to being the only brother in this billion-dollar... Isn't that something? So that what that and because uh, usually if I see a black guy, I say well, he must be Dominican or something like that. Because when apartments where I live, she doesn't hire black dudes. And I saw a black dude. I said, "Oh shit, that's a brother." And then he said, "I say, hey, what's going on? Hey, how's you doing?" Ah oh, shit. I said, "Where are you from?" I'm Dominican. Because we got Hispanics gotcha. who work in there. And so obviously, are oh, there's the foreman white guys or Hispanic guys? They're both. Mostly white guys, so. And so you're black. You're actually one of the leaders here. Okay. Well, cool. What's your name, brother? Paul. Hey, Paul. What's up, man? Uh, Damn. So, because over there, the other one too. That uh, that site over there. And this, I said, huh? So the Venezuelans have made it here too, huh? <laughs> yeah. That's what it is, man. Yeah. So, but I'm, I know. I don't know, am I the first person ever asked you or am I the one who has had the nerve to come up here and stop you and say, hey, brother, what's, what's really going on? First, but I mean, people look at me, but they don't say anything. Yeah, do you think they're looking at you like, what is he doing here or is he the, okay. I'm looking at you like, damn, they got a black dude? It's like, it's, it is, this is a multi-billion dollar, all this shit, over here and over there across the way, and I don't see nothing but them. And I'm just wondering if that was an issue. So you live in Texas, or they, did they bring you in from somewhere else? Do you? Well, welcome, man. Nice to meet you. And hopefully they'll, you know, maybe if you as a superintendent can maybe recruit others. Or oh, let me ask you this. So is, there, is have they bought into the myth that, because, uh, you know, we always say, well, they bring the Latinos and the Hispanics over because, you know, black people or black men don't want to do this work or all that. You think... You think they bought into that myth, or they just use that myth as an excuse not to hire black men? I cannot tell. You know, I've never been in Richard, the big man. Uh huh. But, but you can see the result, yeah, I can though. I just see, like, there's just the gap. Uh huh. I can so, see the gap. I can see, like, there's um, more the demographics, and also, this is just different. Okay. Um, do, would you know if there's, like, Huh. Okay, I'm sorry. Well, okay, well, thank you for the, the few moments. But so as you walk away, do you see brothers even apply for these kind of these construction jobs? Okay, might have been scared. But I appreciate you, man. Thank you, man. All right, enjoy your day. All right, y'all, what y'all just saw uh, was me. Uh, all right, hold on, y'all. We're going to get back to it in a minute. Uh, okay. Okay, we're going to get back to the topic here. Maybe I, Maybe I should make this the topic. I walk past this construction every day. Not every day, but it's over here. This construction, they're building like hotel, and they're building a big ass, no, this billion dollar construction. And I just happened to see as I was about to start my actual live here. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know if y'all heard him, but he's a brother from Nigeria. But I said, damn, there's a black dude over there because they don't seem to have many black men in these multi million and billion dollar constructions. A uh, project is going on all around here in this area and probably a lot of places where you live. You see all these multi these hotels, these 
these apartment complexes and all that, you don't see black men. And that's why I asked him, is, is you think that they're using the myth or the falsehood that black men aren't into construction, uh, structural engineering or any of that, and they use that as a front or an excuse not to hire black men to be contractors or supervisors or you no know, just construction workers because all them Latinos, every time I walk past y'all see not one black male face, I don't see any women, so, but any black male face in these construction sites. So what y'all just heard me do was a, a impromptu interview with a, the lone leader. He said he the only black dude and he's from Nigeria. That's why I asked him, are you an American black dude? All right, black folks, nation of immigrants, like they said. And if they're gonna pick a black person, it's not gonna hardly be a black American.